I have called by name Basil, uh, Basil, the son of Ur, the son of Hur, of the tribe of Judah. And I have filled him with my spirit of God in wisdom and understanding and in knowledge and in all manner of workmanship, all manner of workmanship, um, to device clinging works to the gold and to the silver and cutting of the stone and set of them, um, carving of the timber to all of um, to work in all matters of workmanship. Uh, mine is slightly different because I read from an NIV. So we can look up an NIV. Let's just go look up the NIV version. But you see, you can see the message right here. God blessed, um, uh, what's his name? Ba Basil, son of Ur, the son of Hur, the tribe of Judah. And he's also blessed other people in the Bible with gifts and talents. Oh, well, this is just, let's look at the NFA. Then the Lord said to Moses, See, I have chosen Basil, son of Basil, son of Ur, the son of Hur, of the tribe of Judah. And I have filled him with the spirit of God, with wisdom, with understanding, with knowledge, and with all kinds of skills to make artistical designs for wor the work in gold, silver, and bronze to cut the, and set stones to work the wood and to engage in all kinds of crafts. So it's not bad to have these gifts and talents. So as me as an artist, I'm actually starting to get a little mournful because I, I like to paint. Um... But uh, God says, if you look to it as a, a source of a, of a precious item, that if you know you look to it as though it is a God, you know it's your source of, of income, you know, and this can be looked at as your jobs and and your your uh, your position status, um, your income, you know, how much you're making, and um, it goes much deeper with this this idol tree. And um, we're going to get into that. Um, so modern day idol tree. So I want to uh, flip the camera around. We're going to talk about this modern day idol tree. This is very important. 